gosh. Little Einsteins, it is 8.15 a.m. You are going to be extremely late for school. Mom, I don't feel so good. I think I got a fever. Yeah, same here. Yeah, yeah us, us too. too. Well, okay. Y'all can stay home today. I hate to say this, but I think we're all catching colds. Yeah, same here. We probably caught them from school last week. And by the way, you better not be lying. If you don't want to go to school, just say that. With the reputation that all of you have, I can never believe you. And I'm saying this for a reason. I swear to Lord, if all of you are faking a fever, it is a belt. Oh my goodness. Mom, we promise you, that isn't the case at all. Ugh, okay. But anyway, I must get going to work. Your grandmother and father will still be here, and I told them you are all sick. Since all of you have fevers, how about you all get some more rest? But you'll still have to get up and eat lunch at 12.30, so that gives you guys over four additional hours of sleep. I'll be back home at 5.37 tonight. Gee, why is that alarm so loud? I have a sharp ring in my ears, and it hurts so bad. I don't know. I probably didn't check the volume on my phone when I was setting the alarm. That almost scared the living shit out of me. And why does it sound like the cursed Android morning alarm? I probably didn't check the alarm sound either. That's the sound for memes on the internet. That's right. But man. It feels good that we're faking fevers, so we don't have to go to school. School sucks complete, ass. But anyway, let's go eat lunch. Um, why do both of you have masks on? What kind of question is that? Because you are all sick, obviously. We don't wanna catch that shit. Why are you guys even downstairs to begin with? Are you slow? No, we're not slow. We just came downstairs to eat lunch. Oh? Okay. Eating may make you feel better. Go for it. Daniel, didn't the kids act like they were feeling well and energized since they got downstairs? Yes. Sick people usually aren't that energized. They were also walking happily. Second, Leo asked me why we have masks on. This is a sign of something. I'm going to tell Kate when she comes home. Hello Dan and Ravina. I'm back from work. What's with the frowns? We have a feeling that the little Einsteins may actually be faking fevers. We have received some signs of them faking. First off, they came downstairs, and Leo asked me why me and Dan had masks on. Second, they didn't look sick when they came downstairs. They were actually very energized. And third, they walked happily and excitedly to the kitchen for lunch. It is apparent that no one wanted to go to school today, since they are apparently faking fevers. So go ahead, put a belt on them and then ground them. Man. Little do the parents know, we were faking fevers all along. I can't believe they fell for it. Ha 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 ha
to make y'all let us stay home. We think that school is boring, stressful, and depressing. Like come on now, what information from school will we use in the real world? School is irrelevant and a waste of time. But anyway, we are all sorry, and we promise this won't happen again. Oh my gosh! Leo, Queen Siani, and June, how dare you fake fevers to trick me into thinking you're all sick, so I would have to let you stay home. You know, y'all may hate going to school, but you can't let that have power over your mind. Y'all may think it's boring, it's depressing, and stressful. But at the same time, you must go beyond that. Don't let your opinions control your actions. This is a lesson that all of you should learn. All of you should definitely get a punishment day for this, but I am doing something else instead, as you may see in my hand. You know what? That's why all of you have such terrible grades. Because you have little motivation. The higher the motivation, the higher the grade. The lower the motivation, the lower the grade. In other words, it's because none of you are trying. You don't have perseverance. You don't have any consideration for school. You feel comfortable just lying down and taking hits from weapons that school is throwing at you. You all won't get anywhere in life because you're not taking life seriously. If you take life seriously, life will take you seriously. Fix it now or we'll fix it for you. Now, will all of you fix it? Or will me, your mother, and your father fix it? We'll do it. Then show us you can do it. Prove it. If your actions attract trouble, the trouble will come for you. If your actions attract peace, the peace will come to you. Life will treat you good, only if you treat it good. Turn it around. Because right now, that's not what it's looking like. It's not looking like any of you will fix it. And freedom requires responsibility. Y'all know what I said earlier. Now turn around and face the wall. Ah! Ouch. My ass is red. Mom, why did you hit each of us twice? Because you all made me super duper mad. Leo, Queen Siani, and June, how dare the four of you fake fevers to stay home? That's it. Each and every one of you are grounded for the half-life of carbon-14. In other words, you are grounded for 5730 years. Upstairs now. Wa 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 w